انا مش بحب دايما يا استاذه جاكلين ويا ريت بقى نصا في الجزء اللي جاي دوت نبقى نوصله لمستر ايريك برنامج اسمه احلام مواطن بنكلم دايما المواطن البسيط بحب اكلمهم بلغه يبقوا بيطمنوا بيها بصفته برضو الوظيفيه بعد ما سالنا الاسئله الرسميه المهمه اللي لازم يبقى بنطمن بيها الناس على الراي العام المصري وعوده العام ولكن هو بما ان جنسيته فرنسي حابب ان انا اخد بقى جزء ايجابي افرح بيه الناس باجراءات الاحترازيه اللي قلنا عليها والعوده شفنا بعض الدول بما فيهم فرنسا اللي هو بلده بدات تبقى في عوده تدريجيه كافيهات مطاعم اعمال وان كان لسه مش بشكل كامل اعلم هذا جيدا ولكن هي بريقه امل عاوزه يوجه رساله للشعب المصري بما انه فرنسا بدات ترجع علشان نبدا يعني نقتضي بقى بجزء ايجابي من دول سبقانا ولكن في نفس الوقت هو بيقيم العوده دي ازاي وهل محسوبه ولا متسرعه Uh, our program here uh, speaks about the dreams of people, so we need to speak, uh, use the language that everyone can understand. <laughs> yes, the Easy everyone. Yeah, just, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, we are, we are citizens, we are normal people, and we want uh, to listen or to hear the language that would make us feel more comfortable. So now we are, uh, uh, you are French, you come from France. Uh, But I'm and now more people. Right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you are, you come from France and we have heard that there are measures uh, for the return of the gradual return of people and uh, opening of like cafes, restaurants, of course gradually, but there, uh, there are measures to do this or, or procedures to do this. So what do you think, uh, if, if I'm asking you to send a message uh, to the Egyptian people, uh, what do you think uh, about this uh, return? Is it very quick? Is it slow? Should we postpone it? Should we do it? What do you think from your perspective? Even by point, yeah, and faster yeah. point. Maybe. Well, I think that uh, we need to listen to the messages sent by the government and by the WHO. Um, and WHO is doing a fantastic job in Egypt, uh, supporting the Ministry of Health and the government. Uh, that this, they will decide on when we can reopen uh, the economy, which sectors can be reopened, uh, which part like restaurant, hotels can be, can be open. Uh, some hotels now are open, but with limited capacity in Egypt. Uh, that's, uh, we see, I think, when, if you mention France or Italy or Spain, They start to reopen, and in fact, it's probably quicker than we expected in terms of return to not normal, but to uh, to go back to the restaurant, to go back to uh, to, to hotels. To uh, the Eiffel, Eiffel Tower will be soon open. Of course, each time with some measures in terms of social distancing mm. uh, and sanitizer, as I mentioned earlier. But it seems that the reopening is probably faster than we expected because we, we are afraid of second wave and it seems that there is no second wave, uh, in, at least in Europe or uh, in, uh, in Asia. Uh, then I think, yeah, there is hope. I know we don't know when it will be completely back to normal. Uh, I think we have to, uh, I think a lot of laboratories are working on a vaccine and then hope that uh, it will be soon uh, ready. Uh, but uh, when I see now my, my friends in, in France, in Paris, uh, and some of them got the virus, uh, they got sick. Uh, and yes, no, it's, uh, they are much more um, relaxed, it's much more they can see their family, uh, they can see their parents. Uh, my mother was blocked at home for two months, seeing nobody. Uh, and of course, me blocked in Cairo, I cannot see her too, but uh, I hope that I can see her very soon in July. But I think, yes, I think that's. Uh, Uh, soon uh, everything will be much more relaxed for people. But it doesn't mean that we have to, uh, to, to be too relaxed. We have to continue to, have the same, uh, to apply the same measures in terms of masks, in terms of social distancing, no kissing, no hugging. That's very important. And, until the, uh, and that's why I say it's very important to follow the recommendation made by the authorities and the WHO in the case of, uh, uh, of uh, health and safety. How, uh, um بيقول ان الرسالة الاساسية هو ان احنا لازم نستمع الى حكومتنا ونستمع الى الاجراءات اللي بتتخذها لان الحكومة عندها علاقات قوية جدا وتعاون مع منظمة الصحة العالمية فبالتالي هم بيقدموا لهم الدعم هم اللي يقدروا يقرروا اي من القطاعات قادرة على انها ترجع 
والشكل اللي هتعود بيه القطاعات دي للشكل الطبيعي انا عارف انه في فرنسا وايطاليا واسبانيا في حصل نوع من العوده نوع من العوده كان اسرع من المتوقع بالزبط. شويه بالزبط. بالرغم يا ايوه كان في اجراءات اتخذت ولكن هو كان اسرع من المتوقع كل اوروبا واسيا دلوقتي خايفه من الهجمه الثانيه من من الفيروس ف امتى هنرجع كامله بالشكل الطبيعي ما حدش عارف هنستمع للاجراءات او هنستمع للارشادات اول باول هننتظر لما يكون في فاكسين بصل علشان نقدر ان احنا يبقى نبقى مطمنين في باريس لما الناس رجعت في ناس يعني جالها المرض مره ثانيه عيد مرضت مره ثانيه أه بس كانت فرصة طبعا الناس تشوف بعضها هو بيقول ان هو شخصيا والدته فضلت محبوسة شهرين ما بتشوفش حد هو شخصيا محبوس في القاهرة أه ف أه يعني أه يعني دي واضحة من نسباله في الجزئية بتاع التقييم بس ما نتطمنش قوي بالضبط طيب